conference today was Bitcoin. For more on that, let's bring in Bitcoin bull John Pfeffer of Pfeffer Capital. John, great to have you on the program. Great to be here. Um, I want to go right to what you were predicting um, at the conference, and that is that Bitcoin will rise to no less than 90,000 and potentially as high as 700,000. What sort of time frame are you looking for, and can you sort of lay out the case for, for the bear case, I guess, if you want to call it that, for 90,000, and the bull case, which is 700 grand? Well, sure. The bear case is zero. But um, okay. uh, listen, these are, these are all, I think people should think about crypto assets, Bitcoin, as, as, as a venture capital investment. It could go to zero, um, but there's a chance that they could be worth much more. In the case of Bitcoin, the $90,000 price would be what it would be worth if Bitcoin became equal to uh, private gold bullion holdings, about $1.6 trillion of, of total value compared to $150 billion or thereabouts today. Um, and, um, you know, it's, 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 a, it's a bet. It's a risk that, that I think is interesting and, and, and I'd be willing to take. On the higher end, you could get to higher values if Bitcoin becomes a major reserve currency, i.e., you know, countries begin to take Bitcoin into their reserves, uh, and in that case, it could reach several hundred thousand dollars. I think the probability of that is lower, but it's certainly a prob it's possibility, and, and that's what you do when you make a venture capital investment. You're betting on, on, on potential outcomes. Did you come up with a million dollar based on a formula, or did you come up with a million dollars of assumption of what you think is going to take place? I came out of two ways. I looked at the number of users, the user growth, and I, I chose a million because it has to be more than a million. I can guarantee it. Um, I, I came at it that way. It came up with maybe between three and seven million. I came at it the, the mining way, okay, which I believe is a lot more valid. The last Bitcoin to be mined. Okay, there's 10,000 miners. Thank you, Jimmy. The difficulty wait for that last Bitcoin is going to be almost infinite. It's going to cost four to five billion dollars to mine that last coin. And miners are going to do it. The value of that coin has got to be more than the work put in to mine the fucker. So if it costs, let's say, even $1 billion, all right, so $1 billion, the last one, why don't you work backwards from there and find out what the end of 2020 is going to be? So two ways come up with the same number. Between, that's 5 million is probably the, the thing. 1 million, it's way outside the lower range, so I'm, I'm very safe. <laughs> it's, it's fascinating watching your level of conviction that you have it's, in the, it's in the not, product. It's not a level of conviction. I look at reality as objectively, not with what I wish it would be, but what it actually is.